Hey, what's up guys and welcome to a brand new episode of Spike Reviews. I know, I know, I've only been uploading like once a week, once every two weeks, but I've had a lot of stuff to do, okay? Life gets in the way, uh, but I promise I'm going to be uploading a lot more consistently because YouTube's about consistency, as my boy Pat would say, and it's true. Shout out to Pat and Jay Meezy, by the way. But uh, I try everything and everything and anything pretty much here. And uh, as always, I found this not looking for it. It was just on the shelf and I was like, yeah, uh, now I've seen everything. Well, maybe not, but I bring you Mrs. Buttersworth's Fruity Pebbles flavored pancake slash waffle syrup. Yeah, I know that that scissor got that Fruity Pebbles flavor now. But anyway, the bottle just catches your eye immediately. I looked up at the shelf and I saw a bright red bottle amongst all the other bland, boring, brown syrup bottles that you usually see at the store. It was just all regular syrup and then bam, fruity pebble syrup. Yeah, I know. All right, so I don't have waffles or pancakes with me, so this is just gonna be raw, raw scissor test, but um, do I have a spoon? Let me get a spoon. Spoon acquired, it's gold. Yeah, cool, huh? All right, so needless to say, this is probably gonna be very, very sweet. There is 22 grams of sugar with 22 added grams per two tablespoons. So this shouldn't be too bad. I'm not gonna fill it up either, but yeah. All right, let's do the old smell test. Cause if it smells like Fruity Pebbles, it's probably gonna taste like Fruity Pebbles, but I don't know. Let's see, is this open already? All right, get the little plastic thing off. All right, we're good to go. Put this back on. Try trying to spill it. Oof, smell test. Yeah, that definitely smells like Fruity Pebbles. That's crazy. It smells like you're sticking your head inside of a box of Fruity Pebbles. It's kind of awesome, to be honest. All right, here we go. Here goes nothing. Let's see. Hopefully I don't get it on my keyboard. It's like I'm pouring like cough medicine. Like, you know, it looks the same as the stuff that you would drink when you were a little kid. All right, here we go. Cheers, guys. Fruity Pebbles, pancake syrup. Cheers. Mm. All right, one more little taste for science. Ooh, that's sweet. Hmm. Okay, right off the bat, it's got that little medicine-y taste that I expected it would have. The Fruity Pebbles flavor is there. It's really strong, but at the same time, like on the back end, I get kind of like a plasticky taste, and maybe because it's not meant to be consumed like straight up like this, but it's got a really artificial taste. I mean, come on now, it's Fruity Pebbles and syrup, but I can't help but taste that little plasticky taste at the very end. Uh, it's super sweet, but it does capture the Fruity Pebbles taste. Now on looks alone, it's it's awesome. It's an awesome bottle, packaging, I'm a sucker for it. But taste wise, I don't know. Maybe my rating would go up with actual waffles or pancakes, but for now as is raw, it's gonna get like a seven out of 10. And the reason I'm giving it such a high score is because the packaging is awesome and the smell is very prominent. So it is what it advertises. But I'm not going any higher because it does taste kind of like plastic a little bit and it was a little bit off-putting but overall I love to see unique products like this I like it when companies step out of their comfort zone and try something different so kudos to Mrs. Buttersworth nice all right guys that's gonna do it for this episode of spike reviews as always please like comment and subscribe hit that little bell so you're notified every time I drop a brand new video be kind to each other wash your hands and I'll see you in the next one hopefully like in two days or something we'll figure it out peace